chasing them out and about and the bike stopped working. The bike stopped working. I don't know what's wrong with it. It just won't go anymore. It's not responsive. I'm a little far from home. It's getting dark, I'm getting scared. Yeah, I don't know what to do. I'm trying to fix it, but it's not working. I was going somewhere cool too. Worst comes to worst. I just have to ride it like a normal bike. But it's heavy. I don't know what's going on, look. It's supposed to go. No Super 73, what's going on? I'm gonna mess with it, but as as of right now, we're stranded. Even though it's a bike, it's not working. It's just straight up broken, I don't know. Oh well, I'm gonna ride it like a normal bike, but this bike is so heavy because of all the like stuff. Uh, it's super hard to ride, but it'll work. Let's go somewhere and then we'll talk. a whole new world. I got a new tripod, but more than that, if you have noticed, maybe you have not noticed whatsoever. I got a new lens, baby. A little more artsy. I don't know if you could tell, but I can tell, and I think it's better. And I want to talk to you guys about a little something today that has been on my mind. And something that I've learned over the years, and hopefully it can add value to you. It's about investing in yourself. That's right, you. <laughs> Basically, what I'm doing with this lens, what I'm doing with this new setup is I'm investing in myself. I'm investing in the videos, the things that I love to do, the things that I love to create. And I'm talking to a very specific amount of people here. I think some people just feel like something you want to do, something you want to accomplish, something you want to do with this life. I remember feeling that for such a long time where like I just felt something in me that a lot of other people around me weren't doing what I wanted to do. And so so I invested my time into making videos, for example, and that's when I was still in New Mexico and I wanted to come to California and make videos and just see what I can do out here, create, and I did. So if you have a feeling kind of like how I did back in the day, and I still feel it right now, I still feel a want and that's what I'm doing right now with this new lens and this new little setup is I'm kind of refreshing the investing into myself because it's up to you. If you want to do something, if you have a dream, if you have a goal, it's up to you to invest into yourself to make that happen because it's not just going to happen because you will. It. It's gonna happen when you make moves, baby. I remember a time when I first moved to California and I really wanted a drone, for example. And I remember my dad telling me, invest in yourself. If you want a drone and you think it's gonna make the videos better, invest in yourself. You're spending money to make something better, something that you believe in, something that you're doing. That day, I went out and got a drone and I put it in the videos and I felt creative and I felt like I was doing good. I unfortunately made that drone crashed into the ocean. But for that time being, it was a great time. <laughs> so like I said, investing in yourself isn't just money, although it can be money, but a lot of it's time, even picking and choosing who you surround yourself with. I know it's a little difficult in this time and we're all kind of to ourselves a little bit more because we have to. Even in high school, I remember there's a lot of people that were my friends and they're great people and there's nothing wrong with it, but they were just super into the party scene and I really wasn't. I don't drink, I never drank. It's not my thing. At that time, I started making music and I really got into music and recording and investing time into myself, investing time into that. A few different people took that as me not wanting to be friends anymore or this or that, but they stayed partying and I started to you know invest time into doing what I wanted to do to grow to where I want to grow to do something. So sometimes you have to kind of switch things around and do something a little bit different to do what you want to do, but it's all for a good goal. A lot of people maybe won't get it. They might think you're wasting money. They might think you're wasting your time. I want to encourage you guys that if anyone's saying that to you or people don't understand what you're doing, that's okay. They don't have to, as long as you know what you're doing, or at least are trying to like, you kind of know the path that you want to take. You have control to do whatever you want. You guys can do whatever you want. You can be whoever you want to be. All you have to do is kind of understand where you want to go, start making baby steps in that direction, and go. We only live once. Why not do what you want to do? Jim Carrey said this one thing at a graduation once where he was talking about his dad getting a safe job because he wanted security, he wanted safety instead of following his passion. What ended up happening was the company ended up like going out of business, bankrupt or something, and he lost his job. And so, so he was saying something like, you can fail at something that you don't want to do, so you might as well do what you want to do. 
Does that make sense? Failure is good. Get used to failing. Failing is good. It means you're trying. You might not get it every time, but guess what? If you stop after you fail, then you actually fail. If you fail and then keep going, try something different, keep going, try something different, you never really fail. Failure is just like a scary word for people, but don't be afraid to fail. It's okay. Even making the decision to move from New Mexico to California, it's a jump, it's a leap of faith. But all I was thinking was the worst case scenario is I'm going to fail, come back to exactly where I am right now. So might as well try. I know everyone's situation's different and I'm very empathetic to that. I just wanted to maybe give you guys some knowledge that I have and just share it and see what you can do with it or if you want to twist it into something else or hopefully it inspires you or motivates you because that's the whole thing of this. If I could possibly add value to you in any sort of way besides just entertainment, let me know if you want more of these videos because I have a lot of thoughts. I guess on this just by saying, don't worry what everyone else thinks. If you have a feeling you're supposed to do something or if you have a feeling you want to try something don't worry about anyone else approving it you got that thought in your head for a reason see where that leads it might be somewhere great follow your passion do what you want to do just don't stop yourself from doing something because other people say you can't do it or what are you doing or make you feel weird about just it. just know i believe in you guys so much do what you want to do also comment down below and let me know what you guys have like what are your dreams what is your like dream job or what is your passion that you want to do don't worry about what the world thinks just go for it dude just go for it. Oh, hi, puppy. Hi, puppy. What are you doing, boy? What are you doing, puppy? Hi. Cap, do you want to go to the park? Do you want to go outside? You do? You do? Let's go. Let's go, boy.